Il y avait un livre qui me fascinait quand j'étais petit, c'est Le Petit Prince, le livre Le Petit Prince. And when I was a kid, uh, there was one book that he really loved that was really, really fascinated him. And that book is the one that's here with us today, Le Petit Prince, The Little Prince. Livre magique, plein de poésie. It's a magical book and it's full of poetry. Qui a été écrit par Antoine de Saint-Exupéry. And the book was written by a man named Antoine de Saint-Exupéry. Yeah. Check it out please. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. 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 It was then that the fox appeared. Good morning, said the fox. Good morning, said the little, uh, the little prince responded politely, although when he turned around, he saw nothing. I am right here, the voice said, under the apple tree. Who are you? asked the little prince and added, you are very pretty to look at. I am a fox, the fox said. Come and play with me, proposed the little prince. I am so unhappy. I cannot play with you, the fox said. I am not tamed. Ah, please excuse me, said the little prince. But after some thought, he added, what does that mean, tame? You do not live here, said the fox. What is it that you are looking for? I am looking for men, said the little prince. What does that mean, tame? Men, said the fox. Well, I'm going to skip ahead. So they become very good friends, and they spend time together, and he tames the fox, and they become very close. But at some point, the little prince realizes that he has to uh, leave, and they have to separate, even though they're very close friends. And so this is when they decide it's time to go. Goodbye, he said. Goodbye, said the fox. And now, here is my secret, a very simple secret. It is only with the heart that one can see rightly. What is essential is invisible to the eye. What is essential, what is, essential is invisible to the eye, the little prince repeated, so that he would be sure to remember. It is the time that you have devoted to your rose that makes your rose so important. It is the time I have devoted to my rose, said the little prince, so that he would be sure to remember. Men have forgotten this truth, said the fox, but you must not forget it. You must become responsible forever for what you have tamed. You are responsible for your rose. I am responsible for my rose, the little prince repeated, so that he would be sure to remember. And they became responsible for each other, too. Mercier peut-être la Fondation Antoine de Saint-Exupéry qui euh, nous permet à nous, mais euh, un peu partout dans le monde, d'avoir ce type d'action. Yeah. So, we would also like to thank the Saint-Exupéry Foundation because they made this uh, us coming here possible and they do the same sort of thing elsewhere and uh, across the world. And I think Shailene actually said something quite interesting there when uh, she said that Claude maybe would like to, you guys to carry on with the drawing as well because I know that's one of the passions in Claude's life is everything to do with art but particularly getting people drawing. So yeah. Okay, good. Mark, Mark, do you want to say anything to this group of lovely young people? You know, I, I would love for you guys to keep drawing. I'm amazed by Claude's artwork, and I'm really a fan of the book because it's something that you can touch and feel as well as read. And I would love for you to create more artwork. I think the world needs more uh, artwork, and we'd love to see all your 
uh, drawings continue. Yeah. And thanks for having us today. Thanks for letting us come.